the role of the non-party actors uh, in this game is to convince politicians that we have entered uh, a new time phase that the narrative is changing and this is a very recent development maybe only came up uh, over the last yeah three to four years that we can now really say that renewables are cost competitive in almost all regions of the world and uh, for many policymakers that hasn't um, arrived in their minds yet you often get the impression because very much they listen to the to the old story to the old orthodoxies mm -hmm. and the role of non-state actors such as my um, think tank Agora Energiewende is to provide good information, good fact-based studies uh, to show the parties uh, and the governments that it's in their own interest to act decisively on climate change. We have uh, multiple benefits. We don't only um, reduce uh, CO2 emissions, but also we have cheaper electricity, we have less dependence uh, on imports, um, and less pollution uh, for yeah, health problems uh, in densely populated areas. So uh, it's a lot of countries who have been moving ahead here and very importantly they're doing that out of their own interest and not necessarily um, because they want to do something against climate change. It just has become economic now to invest uh, in renewables. Us, uh, think tanks like us, um, provide good data and do studies on a country by country level because mm -hmm. it's very important. It's very difficult to um, translate success stories we had in some countries to other countries. So we have to do country by country cases and these studies will show in most countries, I'm very convinced of that, that it's economically efficient to invest in renewables now. and. That needs to be done by think tanks like us um, who are independent and uh, what is very important that we need to break the information link that incumbent actors like power utilities who own conventional power plants are the only one who have enough funds, who have enough credibility to talk to governments because this is what is happening in the moment. So we need to build up more think tanks like that to provide good information to government and if they understand these informations they will increase their ambitions um, just out of their own interest because it makes sense to uh, do climate protection.